everyone, welcome back to my channel. Our most essential learning competency is solving situational problems involving ellipse. Example 1. Find the general equation of the ellipse whose vertices and foci are on the line x is equal to negative 3. One focus at negative 3, 6. Length of the major and minor axes are 10 and 6 respectively. Let us illustrate first the problem. It says here that our foci and vertices lies, lie on x is equal to negative 3. So this one is x is negative 3. Okay. Meaning to say our ellipse has a major axis parallel to the y. And you have this formula. 1 minus k squared over a squared plus x minus h squared over b squared is equal to 1. Now, it says here that our major and minor axis are 10 and 6. When we say major axis, it is the whole axis and the half of it is represented by a, that is 5. Meaning this one is the distance from the vertex to the center. And your B is half of the minor axis, which is 6. It's 3. Now, we know that A is the distance from the vertex to the center. But we do not know yet the center. We know also that C is the distance from the focus to the center. We have the focus negative 3, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay. So we will be getting first the C. So that we can identify, of course, our... This one is F sub 1. We have to find first our C so that we can identify the center. So we have the formula C squared is equal to, of course, A squared minus B squared. So we have 5 squared, 3 squared, this is 25 minus 9, this is 16, this one is equal to 4. Our C is equal to 4, meaning to say just count 4 down. So that is 1, 2, 3, 4. So this one is your center. And the center has coordinates negative 3, 2. We now have the A, the B, and of course our center. We are now ready to find the equation. So this is Y minus 2. Our A is 5 plus X minus negative 3 over 3 squared is equal to 1. This one is already our standard form of equation. So, finding the general, of course, we will expand this. This is y minus 2 squared over 25 plus x plus 3 over 9 equals 1. So, we get the LCD of 25 and 9, that will be equal to 225, if I'm not mistaken. 25 times 9, that is 45, carry 4, 18, 22, it's 225. So, you divide 225 by 25, that will be 9. Y minus 2 squared, plus, you divide it, that will be 5. That will be 25. x plus 3 squared is equal to, of course, 225. So, getting the general, let's expand it. That is 9y squared minus 4y plus 4 plus 25 x squared plus 6x plus 9 equals 225. So simplifying it, we have 9y squared minus 36y 
plus 36 plus 25x squared plus 150x plus 225 equals 225. Okay. So we can now cancel this one. Since they are both 225. And then finally we have 9y squared plus 25x squared minus 36y plus 150x plus 36 is equal to zero. So meaning this one is the general form of the equation of this ellipse. If I will be sketching it, this one is four, so you have to go down four also. Two, three, four. This one is your F sub two. And your vertex is of course, that is five. So going here and going here. And your minor is three, so it's one, two, three, it's here and it's here. So roughly, this is the graph. Okay, that's it. Example number two. Find the general equation of the ellipse with vertices at negative 1, 7 and negative 1, negative 5 and each lattice rectum of length 6. Again, we need to illustrate the problem. We have negative 1, 7, negative 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Assuming that that is the point. Negative 1, negative 5, negative 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This one is the other vertex. This is V sub 1, and this one is V sub 2. The lattice rectum is, of course, 6. So, meaning to say, if this is 1, 2, 3, this is 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. So, we have the formula for lattice rectum that is 2b squared over a. How are we going to solve for the a, the b, and the c? As you can see, again, this one is, of course, our major axis. Meaning, we will be using the formula again, y minus k squared over a squared plus x minus h over b squared is equal to 1. So we need to look for the a, the b, and of course the center. Actually, we can find the center here now because you have the vertex. The vertex 1 is negative 1, 7, and the vertex 2 is negative 1, negative 5. So we just look for the center by using of course the midpoint formula so that is h is equal to adding the two x's negative one plus negative one and divide it by two so that will be your h negative two over two h is negative one and then for the k you have to add the two y's seven plus negative five over two k is equal to 2 over 2, our k is equal to 1. So we have now the vertex, or the center rather, the center, c, negative 1, 1. We now have the center and, of course, the lattice rectum has a length of, of course, 6. This one is equal to 6. So 6 is equal to 2 b squared over a okay so how are we going to solve for the a and for the b because we need them here we know that a is the distance from the vertex going to the center our center is negative one one it's negative one one it's here okay so this is negative one one so we have to get this one and that will be our a of course using the distance formula this is a equals x for x negative 1 minus negative 1 plus y for y 1 minus 7 so a is equal to 
this one is 0 this is negative 6 so a is equal to square root of 36 so a is equal to 6 we now have the a so we need to look for the b so we have 6 lattice rectum is equal to 2b squared over our a is 6 this one is 36 is equal to 2b squared okay you divide both by 2 so that will be b squared is equal to 18. getting the square root that will be b is equal to 9 times 2 that is 3 square root of 2 that is our to b. find the general equation of the ellipse our a is 6 our b is 3 square root of 2 our center is negative 1 1 so this is hk so we have y minus 1 over 6 squared this one is x minus negative 1 over 3 square root of 2 squared is equal to 1 so we have y minus 1 36 plus x plus 1 this is 18 is equal to 1 getting the lcd this is actually the standard form of the equation of the ellipse. Getting the LCD so that we can find, of course, the general equation. This is uh, y minus 1 squared plus 2 x plus 1 squared is equal to, of course, 36. Expanding it, we have y squared minus 2y plus 1 equals or plus 2 x squared plus 2 x plus 1 is equal to 36 okay so we have y squared minus 2 y plus 1 plus 2 x squared plus 4 x plus 2 is equal to 36 so combining like terms we have y squared plus 2x squared minus 2y plus 4x. This one is 2 plus 2 minus 36 plus 2 or plus 3 minus 36 is equal to 0. So finally, our the general form of the equation of the ellipse, therefore, is y squared plus 2x squared minus 2y plus 4x minus 33 is equal to 0.